Hello everyone, it's Joe from OnePageZen.com, and today in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to configure expires and cache control headers for your WordPress Bitnami website on Google Cloud Platform. So I just ran a performance report for my website OnePageZen.com here on GTmetrics.com, and I noticed that I'm getting an F grade for leverage browser caching and for add expires headers. So these are the two things that we're gonna fix in this tutorial. So let's get started. So the first step is to head on over to your Google Cloud Platform account and go to your VM instances and then connect to the instance that's running your website. All right, so now that you've connected to your instance, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to enable the expires module. So I'm going to uh, copy and paste the command to our httpd.conf file. And I have all of these commands listed in the tutorial at onepagezen.com. And I've included a link to that tutorial in the description to this video. So after you've pasted this command, press enter. And now in the upper right hand corner of the terminal screen here, Let's go to Control plus W, click that. And we're gonna search for expires. And here next to this load module, expires, I'm going to delete the pound sign here. All right, now I'm gonna do Control X, and then press Y, and then press Enter. And this saved the change that I just made to the file. So now the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to paste the command to open up our httpd-app.conf file. And in here is where we will add our expires and cache control headers. So press enter. Now I'm going to scroll down right above this section that starts with if define use PHP FPM. So right in this area here, I'm going to copy and paste the following section of code. All right, so this first section is our cache control headers, and this second section is our expires headers. So once you've done that, do Control X, Y, and then press Enter. Now the last thing you have to do is restart your Apache server. So to restart the Apache server, I'm going to copy and paste the following restart command here and press enter. All right. So the last thing that I'm going to do here is go back to GT metrics and I'm going to retest uh, my domain to get a, a new performance report. So I'm gonna click that retest button. All right, so now you can see here, we have a 97 grade on leverage browser caching. And then for add expires headers, we have a grade of 90 of 89. So that's great. That's a huge improvement to what we had before. And we can also check out the waterfall tab here and look at some of these uh, individual assets. And what we'll see here is that the expires is set to a one year from now, just as we configured it. And also the max age is set to exactly how we configured it in our httpd-app.conf file. So it looks like both of these are being recognized, which means that the configuration is working correctly. So that's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the box below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check out this tutorial at onepagezen.com where I have each of the copy and paste commands listed individually. Thanks a lot for watching.